You know, a lot of people ask me what this tank is when I call it a Slick 60. This is the original 1960 N60. Most people don't realize that what this tank actually is. It's a round turret that is based on the uh, M48A2, A3, slightly modified for being a new turret, and then they mounted a new cupola on it, and they called it the N60. It's got the uh, M68 105mm gun, and this is the, uh, the newest tank the U.S. Army had in 1960 for about two years until they came up with a new turret for the M60A1, which most people are familiar with. But I call this tank my Slick 60. So, when they were delivered, they were originally uh, a semi-gloss olive drab, and they were shiny like this. I made this tank using a Tongdae M60A3 chassis and the turret from the IDF tank that they sell. Uh, I didn't install any of the armor on it. I had to fill all the holes with Bondo and sand it all out and putty it and clean up the turret. And then uh, I mounted the cupola from the M60A3 turret and the spotlight that I carry, uh, that I have JVM make for me, and I installed the M68 scale gun barrel that I have. That's the unheat shielded gun barrel. So uh, it makes a pretty nice looking tank. I run, this is the all metal version. I run an 8.4 nickel metal hydride and I run plastic tracks because the metal tracks are ungodly heavy and uh, they really bog the tank down. So uh, you can see here I got my nice jerry can right there. I carry a bunch of those. Those are from Hang Long if you want to go find them yourself. But I carry them. You notice it's got the little little carrier and everything on it. So I carry those so you can get rid of the uh, European jerry cans that come on the tank. And it really makes a nice looking tank. Uh, I, I like this tank a lot. I drive it really hard and it has been very reliable. Good infrared battle tank. Uh, you just seen me driving it off road, and I was going slow and easy on it. I I tend to get it going pretty hard at times, but I really do like this tank a lot. It's unique, and so far I think I'm the only one that's built, as I call it, an old slick 60. So there you go.